hey, this is a bit of motivation for doing exposures today. So our goal is to return to normalcy, but OCD has skewed um, our beliefs so much. Well, not our beliefs. OCD's beliefs are so skewed from reality and so warped that we're basically being gaslit all the time. So before you do an exposure, it's going to feel really scary, like you're disobeying something that's something bad or horrible is going to happen if you don't do it. But it's a lie. And we're basically... I'm returning to normalcy. This is... If we're like on the spectrum from like... And I don't mean this judgmentally at all, but this is the OCD. If we judge it from like normal to abnormal, right? Or maybe it's like... I'm trying to think if it's like a line. What is that thing called like where it's like a bar, right? Like from a range, a scale. We're so far extreme and we're not noticing it. So every time we're doing exposure, we're moving closer to normalcy. So we just have to remind ourselves that it's going to feel weird. It's going to feel like we're betraying something and we're going to be doing something bad, but it's actually far from the truth. We're actually becoming more and more normalized in how people typically respond to situations. And it's not going to feel like that at first. So before you do an exposure, I'll give you an example. And I think it's helpful to see how a typical person responds versus someone that has OCD. So like if I'm worried about wearing this shirt because it's contaminated, right? Based off of my beliefs that it's good or bad, or it's an unlucky or lucky shirt. If I put it on, I can say to myself, I'm returning to normalcy. Because a typical normal person would not have these thoughts. And the good thing with people that have OCD, a lot of the time we have insight into whether it's OCD thought or not OCD thought. So that's like the general basis for how we determine if something's OCD or not. We have that awareness to know that it's not typical. So I'm returning to normalcy. I'm reminding myself I'm returning to a normal life. I hope this helps.